The Prey Campaign. Mission 3. Home run. It worked. Friendly forces have received your message and help is on the way. The bad news is that now your presence has been noticed and an enemy unlike any other has arrived. Can you hold out? Or is this the last stand? Okay, this is the mission layout for Mission 3. We're using the same map as last time. This is the file map. So, we've got the defenders are allowed to deploy anywhere on the table that they choose. I am choosing to focus, if the speaking of focusing, <laughs> um, I'm focusing my team here, 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 and then the sergeant up here on his own. The idea is that it's a regular Warhammer game. However, we have 2d6 uh, Hummer Gaunts showing up. So let's see how many we get. Seven. Seven homogons plus the end game boss, which, who for this will be the Carnif. We've got the Carnifex and two homogons down here. The rest of the homogons are over here. Ready to take a run at these two, uh, these four boys in here. Now, the Valkyrie over there. His mission is to uh, arrive from reserve, get onto the board, Fly in and pick up as many of the guardsmen, survivors, sorry, because this is for any race, the survivors as possible. He wins, or the survivors win, if one survivor gets off. But of course, you know, bragging rights and that, and the like, the more people you get off, the more points you get. However, if all the survivors are wiped out, then it's an automatic win throughout the entirety of the campaign to the enemies. If the Valkyrie itself is destroyed, you may call in another from reserve, but you can only have one on the table at a time. So it's one transport, if he dies, reserve next turn. The score is this, so Tyranids, who goes first, sorry. Tyranids, they get a five. Oh dear. The Guardsmen, they get a three. Can we steal the initiative? We do not. It is turn one to the Tyranids. Oh dear. Of all the times not to go first. Right. So, so we're, getting, we're assuming that the instinctive behaviour rule is not in effect. I'm going to march the Tyranid, er, uh, the Carnifex, sorry, straight up the middle. I'm just going to do the movement phase right now and then I'll get back to you. Okay, we're back. So, very high rolls on the Tyranid running. Uh, you can clearly see the boys in this little paddock here are in a bit of trouble. Only half of them have ammunition uh, from the last mission, so uh, this is a bit of a problem for them. Also, these guys have managed to run straight into the room, but it was sixes and fives for the majority of the thing, the phase. So this could be, in fact, a problem for my guardsmen. Okay, let's do the guard shooting phase now, seeing as we can't do anything else. I'm going to put... Okay, now I can't actually really do anything to the Carnifex because all I've got is las guns. So, let's see how this goes. Sergeant, fire on this homogaunt. Rapid fire, three round, uh, two shots. He rolls a one and a two. Uh, sense of that. So, that means that he is in fact now out of ammunition. Two, uh, one last gun shot from him. Onto this guy. He rolls a six. You can't miss it. There we go. And a four. Come on. No, he rolls a one. Never mind. Uh, rapid fire this last gun into him. A six and a one. So he's out of ammunition. God damn it. He wounds. And a six up save. Nope, that homogaunt dies. He gets a three. There we go. So he's dead. Okay. That's another marker for out of ammunition. Oh, God damn it. We're, uh, so that would be, as a quick recap, that would be one, two, three, four, five, six out of eight guys out of ammunition. Oh dear. Anyway, we've still got hand grenades because they don't require it to hit roll. That's a bit of a tip there, but they're wildly inaccurate, as I'm sure as an experienced Warhammer guy would know. Okay, let's go and rapid fire onto this Homogaunt. Threes. He gets a three and a five. That's good. Fours. He gets a 1 and 6. Come on, for camera focus. There we go. And a 6-up save. No, the Homogon makes it. Damn it. 
Alright, that last guy into another one. He gets two twos! That's terrible. Okay then, so that's bad. Okay. Oh god, I've never done this with a camera ever in my hand before. From the guy who's out of ammunition here, let's put him on there, that guy. Hand grenade, it's gonna be sort of martyrdom, but feck it, I'm taking my chances. Hand grenade, direct hit, two fours, nothing. Onto them, onto them sorry. Bottled out onto the Homogaunt. He wounded, he's wounded, sorry, and sixes. Nope, Homogaunt gets blasted. That's two Homogaunts dead. Wave Assault is still in effect though, however, this does, uh, so they get double lives because this is the last assault. However, this does not apply to the Carn effects. The Carn effects only have, or sorry, the end game boss rule. The end game boss only has one life. I mean, for God's sake, I've got to be fair. Okay, then let's do the same thing with these guys over here. So, uh, hand grenade onto, oops, hand grenade onto that gaunt. It's a hit, one wound. Uh, strength three, so. Okay, turn two to the Tyranids. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Uh, let's march... Oh, actually, I'll get back to my movement phase and then I'll get back to you. Quick movement phase. So we've got the... One's got... I'm going to snuck up this building here to meet the Sarge. Uh, the Carnifex is lining up for a charge on these guys and these guys are just being assaulted all around. So let's do Overwatch. So he... Uh, Sergeant here has no ammunition for his last gun, so it goes straight to assault. He assaulted through the building, which uh, the home ground does not have hand grenades, which means the sergeant goes first. Two attacks, fours, two threes. God damn it! All right, sergeant. I mean the home ground. Sorry, three attacks, fours, two hits, fours to wound, one wound. Oh come on, Red! Don't you die on me! Red's fine on his carapace armor. He just keeps fighting. God damn it, Red! You scared me there. Okay, <clears throat> the carnifex unto these guys. How far does he run? I mean, uh, charge, sorry, not run. Seven inches. Let's see how far that is. I presume that's in range. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah, he's in. Now, I can't actually... They're both out of ammunition, and they cannot actually hurt him. So, this could be bad. So, three attacks for the car and effects, one plus one for the charge, and one for two sets of weapons. That's the claws and the talons. Fours. Oh, dear. Two hits. Twos. Two of the survivors are killed. Sorry, fellas. Uh, those two are dead. And he consolidates two inches. So, hmm. Looks menacingly at those guys. Oh, dear. Uh -oh. Okay, uh, that's a problem. Okay, next is uh, the Overwatch in here. So that would be this guy over fire and Overwatch. He rolls a six and a one. So he's out of, ammun uh, he's out of ammunition, but he rolls a hit. He wounds, he kills the Homogaunt off, but he's out of ammunition. Oh, all that previous, all those uh, firefights in the previous mission have taken their toll. As for these two, same thing. Rolls a two and a five, so no hits taken. Uh, they get their attacks back though. Homogaunts are assaulting through cover, they don't have hand grenades, so we go first. So fours to hit the uh, veterans, sorry, that's two, a four and a five. Four and a five again, and two six up saves on the gaunts. A two and a six. Okay, so one's dead. All right. Well, that could have been worse. Yeah. That could have been a lot worse. So now the three attacks from the hummel gaunt. Fours. Uh, a one, a one, and a two. Okay, they were attacking as a unit, the same as we're defending as a unit. So they lose the combat by one. Mean they are on. Uh, Right, so minus one would be leadership five for the Homogaunt. Leadership five for the Homogaunt, and five and a four, so he bolts. Uh, so it's initiative five plus, okay, so the five plus four, that's nine. Do I get a six in order to catch him? I do not. So the Homogaunt just runs 2d6, uh, eight inches back the way he came. Let's just put him up there. Yeah, there he goes. He's making a run for it. Okay, so that's that. Uh, so, yeah, this is getting bad. Okay, turn two to the guardsmen. So, let's see what happens. The Valkyrie, this is turn two to the guard. The Valkyrie has not arrived. Uh, the Sarge is currently battling atop that uh, the pillbox, whatever it's called. 
we have two guardsmen over here that have decided to make a run for it, trying to keep as much distance from this uh, carnifex as humanly possible. Uh, and these guys are busy fortifying the perimeter of this field, waiting for the Valkyrie to hopefully come and pick them up. Uh, I'm going to fire two shots at the last Tomagaunt. Well, toying with fate, but I'll do it. A three and a two, so that's one hit. Fours, that's a five, and a six up save. Damn it, the Homogaunt lives. Okay, the Homogaunt lives. Okay, so now it comes down to the fighting here. Two attacks from the, uh, correction, one attack. And fours, oh dear, two sixes, I hit the camera on a snake. Fours, one hit, oh no. Four up save. He's okay, he got a five. Two attacks from red back, fours. One hit, fours again. Oh, the suspense. Nope, he gets a two. They just keep clawing at each other with the with the stuff. Okay, uh, turn three to the Tyranids. Now, the uh, defeated waves come. So that's one, two, three, four. We treat them as walking in from reserve. So they are on the field now, but yeah. Okay, does he come back? He does, I believe. Yep, that whole moment does handbrake turn. And comes straight back. Ready to wreak revenge on the guy who tried to take pot shots at him. Now, unfortunately, uh, what they haven't realised, of course, is that, uh, yeah, this could be bad all of a sudden. Uh, yeah, this could be very, very bad. Okay, so we keep fighting here. Okay, so... I'm just going to run these guys and come... Okay, so these Homogorns seem to be a lot slower than their previous incarnations, uh, only managing half the distance, actually, of what their predecessors managed to do. Uh, they're going to try the original Homogorn over here. We're going to try him into the barricades. He makes uh, two sets of three, so he's definitely over the wall. Uh, Overwatch from the guy with the last gun. He gets a two and a three. That's not any... That's no good. Uh, one attack from the regular guardsman, because he's attacking through the wall. He hits him. Come on. He wounds him with a bayonet. And a six up save. Damn it, this Homogaunt will not die. Okay, so now it's the original. Now the Homogaunt's attack back. Fours. Oh dear. So that didn't work, so these boys just lock in close combat. The Carnifex, I presume he's in range. Indeed he is. He cannot attack back. He cannot attack back, so it's a case of. Carnifex has three attacks normally. One for the charge, and one for two sets of weapons. Fours. Uh, two, three hits, oh dear. But because I separated them out, there's only going to be one casualty. Twos, that is three deaths. He dies three times. Oh dear. So he's, he's, just, he's just ground to paste under the hoofs of this Carnifex. Oh dear. And he consolidates five inches. Uh, where would I put you? I'm going to put you over this way. So I'm going to have you chase after those guys. Because <clears throat> presu I'm presuming one, two, three, four, five homogons have those three covered, seeing as they don't even have ammunition. Ha 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 ha. Although I have been wrong before. Okay. Uh, so let's try back into this tower. So two homogon attacks. Oh dear. Four, a six and a five. Four to wound. Oh dear. And four up save. Come on. No, we've Sarge has bought it. Ugh. Damn it, we've lost Sarge. Oh dear, oh dear. And this Homogon consolidates two inches, it's just down. Okay, so that's actually two original Homogons, by the way. So yeah, we've got two. As soon as one of these guys dies, and you get two lives left. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Okay. Uh, so that would be turn four for the, uh, no, sorry, that would be turn three for the guard. Okay, so we'll get back to, I'll start doing my movement phase, what little of it there is, and I'll get back to you.